WNBA News, Aja Wilson, Asia Wilson, when I got that MVP. Like she should have. Like she should have. And Kaylin Clark, unanimously, when I got that rookie of the year. Like she should have. Like she should have. So, everything all the like fuss, it. everybody talking what they talking about, man. Hey, and I still say, you know. They didn't have nothing to talk about, man. They, they trying to make up something to talk about. I'm just saying she should have been on the Olympic team. That's all I'm saying. And I, that's all I'm saying. And that's all I'm saying. Sometimes you got to have foresight when they selling that many tickets, making a name for the league, and they can ball. That's for the league, not for the Olympics. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, but it's for the Olympics. Like, we want to make this a worldwide brand, don't we? Like the NBA. We want people in China. We want we want uh, Anta to go sign some WNBA players. Yeah, absolutely. You know? They already have. have they, they already I mean, I'm know, just, just saying, like, we, 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 just we like want that uh, kind Brendan of Griner go. No, the only reason that we know Brittany Griner went to Russia is because she got in trouble. Yes, yeah, Other it. than that, you got all kind of WNBA players go overseas every yeah, year. Yeah, going Cause, overseas. Because that's saying, where the real but, money is. Yeah, exactly. But yeah. how do we get that money back here and, 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 and uh, point it in the WNBA's direction? Because that's what they want. Oh, These yeah. WNBA players want to get paid. And, and the fact yeah. that y'all just didn't, like, the, 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 all that other stuff y'all talking about, Cheryl Swoops, all y'all other haters out there, and I'm going to call you out, man. Because it's blatantly obvious why you're hating on the young lady. If she was black, man, everybody be going crazy by Caitlin Clark right now. And I'm going to just say it like that. That's all I'm going to say. But she not. You know? And, and what I appreciate about it is it, just that. You know, she ain't stereotypical. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can't... Like, she is cold-blooded. And she killing everybody that's stepping in front of her. Oh, black, yeah. white, Hispanic, it don't matter. She killing everybody that come in front of her. She didn't have a good first playoff game. That's why I compared her to Baker Mayfield the other day. We ain't seen what she can do in the, in the playoffs yet. Y'all want to, you know, I ain't saying that she's Asia Wilson, but I'm saying the impact she brings to this game from a financial standpoint as well as production for her team and what she's doing for her team that had 13 wins last year and now they're in the playoffs doing what they're doing. They ain't seen a playoff game in a minute, man. She's she different. She's special. Caitlin yeah. Clark is exactly what the WA, NBA needed. And despite what y'all might be saying now that she's first team all WNBA and she's rookie of the year, despite what y'all saying now, y'all was hating on the young woman. Period. A lot of y'all for the wrong reasons. But if you was actually looking at her game, she'd have been on that on, on that Olympic team. Is all I got to say. That's all I got to say. At that particular point, now at the end you can say that, but at that particular point, I would say no. What you mean? Because we didn't know. We didn't know she was going to be rookie of the year. We didn't know all this. You didn't have to know all that about Diana Taurasi for her to be on the, on, the, on the NBA team, on the Olympic team. Did, we saw enough from her but at this that is point. The, but this is the thing. When Diana Taurasi came, they, they didn't have the caliber of players that they got on the team now. Regardless. That's all I'm saying. Even at that point in the league, it was some cast that was on the team that hadn't played a game yet in the WNBA that was on the Olympic team. You know what I'm saying? And I understand camaraderie and all this other stuff, but... Don't start treating her a certain way just because she got all the shine right now and bringing all the pub to the league. Y'all, they, she was getting treated a certain way because of who she was and what she brought to the table and how much pub she was getting. If she came on in is the, the same way Diana Taurasi did, when, when more of the attention was on Gino Ariema versus Diana Taurasi, you know what I'm saying? Because Di, Taurasi wasn't winning no, and I say Diana Taurasi, I ain't got nothing against her. I love her. She's a great player. She did a lot for the league as well. But she ain't Caitlin Clark. I don't care how many national championships she won. She ain't Caitlin Clark from an impact standpoint on the WNBA. So they penalized her for who she was. That's well, all know, I'm saying. Everything is different now than when than, than 15 years ago. Yeah, it's softer now. Another reason why yeah. Caitlin Clark should have been there. Well, yeah, I mean, I'm just saying the media, the attention, social media, and all that is way larger than it was then. You know, and, I, and I'm going to say it like this. Like you say, Donna Taurasi... Is not Kayla Clark. Kayla Clark ain't down to Tarasa either. For sure. For sure. She yeah, neither, one neither one of them is each other. Neither one of them is each other. And all I'm saying is right. Down to Tarasa would want to be Kayla Clark right now. As much press as she getting. You know, as much money you, as she getting. Exactly. All money. that. That's oh, what yeah. I mean by press. Oh, oh, press yeah. dollars. Yeah. Press media coverage. Yeah, absolutely. Magic also <laughs> probably wish he yeah. was Steph Curry. Yeah. All the money Steph Curry getting. Not to, yeah, no doubt. I mean, I'm That's just saying. That's a fact. Yeah, I mean, yeah. 